Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, so I am back once again after a whole week. So I was busy in my job, so I could not make the video. So guys, in this video, what you will learn is you will learn how to insert data in the real time uh, Firebase database. All right. So in this video, we will insert the data of our uh, of the user so let's get started so first of all let me show you the sign up activity and here we have sign in activity all right so in our sign in activity uh, first of all let me open the firebase console so uh, uh, i am opening the firebase So guys here we will choose the uber all right and we will go to the database and we will click on here we have this uh, parent node all right and we have to click on rules so that which users can access the uh, database so what we are gonna do If we are gonna say true and also we are gonna say true all right and if I simulate and if I click on uh, right and if I click run okay so now we will just click on publish your security rules are defined as public anyone can read or write to your database all right so now what we are gonna do here we have a user so we will uh, delete the user okay and so here we will insert the data all right so how we are going to create the data so first of all uh, we have to click on database and here we will uh, make a node of uh, user and I also write user okay sorry we need to users Okay guys, so here we will write the value as user. where we have uh, users here all right so now what we are gonna do here we first of all need to initialize the firebase database uh, reference sorry database reference database reference and we need to first of all initialize it and so we will initialize it here so when the user will be registered uh, and authenticated so we will just uh, in, uh, create the user so for that we have to use database reference equals to firebase 
database dot get instance dot get reference all right so now we have the reference of this node all right so we need to get the reference of this node you users all right so now what we will do we will say dot child and here we will pass users all right so now we are in the users node so here we what we will do is we will insert the user first of all his name email uh, so, sorry name email and password all right so let me open the uh, sign up activity so here name email and password will be saved so name is edit text 5 edit text 6 and edit text 7 so first of all we need to initialize the edit text all right so uh, i have these uh, edit text in already initialized so here we will just say uh, no okay so we need to create a pojo class all right so the class name will be users okay and here what we will store is uh, the name of the user uh, email and password all right and let me generate the constructor okay so now what we will do is uh, we will say users users equals to sorry user object equals to new user and in here we will pass the three edit text name email and password so e5 name e5 name dot get text dot to string e6 email dot get text dot to string and e7 dot password dot get text dot to string all right so we have created the uh, object of our user class so now we need a unique id user id all right so whenever the user is authenticated here uh, there is the unique id of that user so we need to get the uh, unique id so for that we have to use uh, firebase user firebase user equals to authentication dot get current user all right so now we have the uh, user id we can get so here what we will do we say database reference dot child and here we will pass firebase user dot get user id and we will uh, here set value all right so we will set the value of our this object okay so i copy it and i save it here user uh, object okay so now the uh, information will be saved to the user database so now we need to print or you can say dot add uh, let me say here add on complete listener new on add complete listener and here we check if task is successful so you have to print a message that user data saved all right uh, in our else part we can uh, print a message that user data could not be saved all right 
so guys our code is now complete so let me first of all uh, open the mirror go app let me connect my android phone So guys, I will show you the app. All right. So now my phone is working, and let me run the app on my smartphone. What is the problem? Why it's taking so much time? All right, guys. So now uh, the app will be installed on my phone. So let me here also open the Firebase console. You can see the code here. All right. alright guys so now our application is running so when I click on sign up and I say my name Haroon Haroon at gmail.com and my password is Haroon okay so now when I click on register as you guys can see user registered successfully and user data saved alright so now when we look at our authentication first of all so here we have the name and in our database um, in the user node we have this uh, unique user ID and in here we have email name and password alright so guys if you like the video please uh, share like and subscribe goodbye